Town, Jersey. I'm meteorologist Joe Martucci. You talk about spring fever, but we pretty much hit the fast forward button and went all the way to summer loving. High temperature at Atlantic City International Airport on the mainland as of four o'clock has gone up to 83 degrees. That is a new record high for the date. And to put this in context, our previous record high was 71 degrees, a little bit of low hanging fruit, but we did get the record still. And it is our largest margin of defeat when it comes to our current temperature as opposed to the previous record since February of 1991. It wasn't just the mainland either that have seen this warm air. The marina got up to 79 degrees, our fifth warmest March day and also a daily record. Millville had a daily record as well fourth warmest March day since 1947. We're taking the Q2, we're outside, we're riding bikes on the boardwalk here. We're soaking up the sun, we're soaking up the warm weather that we have here in South Jersey. The reason for this, well, a low pressure system that's in New England. It's giving us west to southwesterly winds around the counterclockwise spinning low pressure system. You see all this warm air here that's coming up from the tropical Atlantic and the Gulf of Mexico. We've seen winds strong at times throughout the day. Highest wind gusts 49 at Atlantic City International Airport. We were in the 40s for all of us here in South Jersey today. And we're going to continue that for the first couple of hours of the evening. But then as we look at our forecast, it's sustained winds. You see them dropping down as we go into the overnight hours. Not only that, they're coming from the northwesterly direction. So a little bit cooler in terms of our temperatures for tonight, as opposed to what we saw last night where lows were in the 50s, but still quite comfortable in the upper 40s everywhere. Still going to be breezy, but it is going to be comfortable. And you could leave those windows open, let the breeze roll on in, as long as you're not too allergic to the pollen that we have here in South Jersey. As we make our way into Saturday, high pressure will be sitting to our south, south, southwesterly wind around that clockwise spinning high pressure system. And that means another warm day for us. Not as warm as the day, but still going to be well above average. Highs of 70 degrees with plenty of sunshine on the mainland here. We'll see that sunshine at the shore too, but that south, southwesterly wind is still a little bit of a sea breeze. And with water temperatures in the mid to upper 40s, we'll get to 61 degrees for our high on Saturday. Moving into Sunday, we have the full worm moon. This is Sunday at 2.48 p.m. That's when the moon will be most full. Of course, you can see it Saturday evening or even Sunday night, but we do have some rain. We'll talk about that in a second. Name for the earthworms that show their head again. And this is considered the last full moon of the winter season. But let's talk about why we're not gonna be able to see this full moon in the sky. That's because we have rain coming. We have strong winds as well, all associated with this cold front that will be sweeping in from the west. We could even be talking about thunderstorms as we go into part of the day on Sunday. So I think what's going to happen is we're going to see rain showers develop just around sunrise and then it will continue until about noon. Then we should break. We could even see some sunshine for a couple of hours during the afternoon. That's when temperatures get into the 60s, though it will be damp and then we will have that cold front come through. That will bring a line of showers and thunderstorms and those thunderstorms could be severe at times. Cloud cover should last into the evening. So again, I don't think we're going to see that full moon unless you're up late Sunday night. You should be able to get some clearing as we make our way into early on Monday morning. Let's take a look at our mainland seven day forecast. Let's get you to Monday. Temperatures in the mid 50s. Believe it or not, that is pretty seasonable for this time of year, but it won't feel like it given the warmth that we've had. We'll have a strong northwesterly wind for our Monday and then we start to rebound with our temperatures as we go into Tuesday and Wednesday. Looks like the middle part of the week will be unsettled with a couple of storm systems passing around and then look at this for Friday. Some cooler air, high temperatures at the shore only in the mid 40s. Have a wonderful weekend, everybody. We'll be back with you Monday with the latest in South Jersey weather. In the meanwhile, you can follow me on social media as I'll keep you updated throughout the weekend there. And you can always come back to our website for the latest radar, satellite, and more at thepressofac.com slash weather.